May the gods watch over your battles, friend. No doubt requesting to garrison his men. Well, out with it. I see. Give the papers to my steward. Don't be daft. Just give me the letter. Hmm. These are interesting reports. Proventus, what do you make of all this? If Ulfric were to attack Whiterun... As in all things, Lord, caution. I urge us to wait and see. Pray wait. I'm of a mind with Ireleth. It's time to act. You plan to march on Windhelm? I'm not a fool, Proventus. I mean, it's time to challenge Ulfric to face me as a man. Or to declare his intentions. He'll do no such thing. He was rather straightforward with Torig. Torig? He simply walked up to the boy and murdered him. That boy was High King of Skyrim. I'm not the High King. But neither am I a boy. If Ulfric wants to challenge my rule in the old way, let him. Though I suspect he'll prefer to send his storm cloaks to do it for him. True. He's already proven his personal strength. Now he seeks to prove his armies. Then might I urge you to consider General Tullius's request? I mean, if you are bent on offending Jarl Ulfric. Ulfric is the one who has offended. But Proventus has a point. Ulfric has made it clear. In his mind, to refuse his claim is to side with the Empire. And what harm is there in letting a few legionnaires die in place of your own men? It seems cowardly. Was it cowardly then to accept the White Gold Concordat? This again? That was different. Was I given a chance to object to the terms of the treaty? No. The Jarls weren't asked. We were told. And we had to like it. The chests of gold didn't hurt. Damn it! This isn't about gold! It's time to decide. Lord, wait. Let us see if Ulfric is serious. Oh, he's serious. But so am I. Finally. You there. I have a message for you to deliver to our friend, the esteemed Jarl of Windhelm. Deliver this axe to Ulfric Stormcloak. Men who understand one another need not waste words. There are but a few simple truths. Ulfric will know my meaning. Good. What is it that you need? Proventus, bring me my pen. And the good parchment. Now are we you don't mind. Why they reform in the dawn? Ulfric won't give us a straight answer. He's a true Nord. He'll come around. Don't be so sure of that. We've intercepted couriers from Solitude. The yes. Empire's putting a make great it quick. Deal of I'm a. Is that so? Gun. I've been wondering when he'd come around. Oh, what's this? Ah, uh, you're quite brave to carry such a message. It's a pity you've chosen the wrong side. You can return this axe to the man who sent it, and tell him he should prepare to entertain visitors. I expect a great deal of excitement in the city of Whiterun in the near future. Sooner than you think. And what would you have me do? If he's not with us, he's against us. We know says I'm too young to train with the sword. 
So I practice with my fists. Sure, I... You've returned with my axe. I knew that would be his response. As soon as you left, I sent word to General Tullius, who's been kind enough to lend us some of his troops and Legate Scipius here. Let Ulfric try to make it past our combined forces. I'll turn you back over to your legion. Legate Scipius will have use for you. Gods be with us all. Now, Take if you don't mind, breathe, soldier. Got a city to keep. But, uh, sir. Breathe. The outer walls are strong. If the storm comes there, in force. Get down to the front line. This is it. We must hold the city. Now move it. The storm cloaks are here, in force. Get down to the front line. This is it. We must hold the city. Now move it.
Son, on me! The Jarl wishes to speak. What's the hurry? Revel in your you victory made it. here <laughs> today. I was sure Even as the down. gods revel in your honor, they already ah! sing of your valor and skill. The halls of Sovngarde are no doubt ringing with your praises. In ah! defeating these stormcloak traitors, you have proven the hollowness of their cause and the fullness of your hearts. The citizens of Whiterun are forever in your debt. But Alfred will not stop here. No, he will continue to strike out against any true Nord who remains faithful to the Empire. He will continue to sow discord and chaos wherever he can. And so, we must, each one of us, continue to fight this insurrection, lest our fallen brothers have died for naught. Lest our honor be lessened, should we allow these bloodthirsty beasts to prowl our lands. Carry on, men. My gratitude and blessings go with you. For White Run, for the Empire. Yeah! 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 Fish and fowl? Treat yourself and your kin to a choice cut of steak or a tender rack of ribs. When the Empire surrendered to the Alt Mary Dominion, they shamed us all. We Grey Maids have been feuding with the Battleborns for years. There's no more bitter enemy than an old. or two for a veteran? It's not much to ask. The Divines saved me from the streets, and they can save you from your trials as well. Are they reforming the... need potions, head over to Angeline's aromatics. By defeating Ulfric at Whiterun, we have solidified the allegiance of the Jarl. Perhaps the Stormcloaks will soon lose heart for this little rebellion of theirs once and for all. I'm promoting you to Quester. Take this blade, a symbol of your new station and responsibility. I'll keep an eye on your progress. The Empire rewards excellence, and so do I. You'd be wasted as a regular soldier. I have special plans. Make your way to our hidden military camp in the Pale. Rico will have important tasks for you, and will need you when we reclaim the capital. You'll be doing whatever Rika tells you to do, and I expect you to find creative ways to disrupt the Stormcloaks along the way. Gods be with you.
He's a true Nord. He'll come around. <laughs>